yeah. Come in here. We're finally back in Whistler after one heck of a long winter. And to top it off, it's a perfect day to be out in the park. But it turns out everyone else had the same idea and the place was packed. Luckily, I'm spending a few days in Whistler thanks to my friends at Sundial Hotel. They've got great spacious rooms, a hot tub on the roof, a private bike repair and wash station, a bike valet with secure bike storage, and the lifts are literally around the corner. So let's get on them and ride some bike park. Oh, good to be back. Garbo closed for another month. Pretty snowy up there. We got Yuka, Eric, from Fangirl Yuka, BCPLV, which you probably already know. All right, crank it up. We go to warm up lap. You gotta get used to going Mach 10 on these trails again. Ah, so new. <laughs> Jumps going so much faster than on regular trails. And you hit these little berms. It's going pretty fast. Hmm, maybe. Manual? No. No, sir. <laughs> All right, definitely not used to jumping the jumps on this thing. Almost died on a tiny little jump. All right, we're on Seymour now. Slightly bigger jumps could warm up for A line. A little bit of A line later. All right, when you ride the bike park, you usually want to have your rebound a little slower because you're going so fast. You want things to be a little more on the stable side. All right, a little more warm up still. It's taking a while to Get up the lift. Oh, there's a line there. I always forget about it. A little sneaky move here. Up over. This is Ninja Cougar. One of the best trails for working on your corners. Hey, is that my bike that's squeaking? Is that Eric's bike? Ooh. My rear tire is a little low, even with the cush car and the downhill casing. Definitely doing a little couple skirts. Oh yeah, a little free ride lines. <laughs> Once the trail gets a little smoother, it's hard for <laughs> me to keep up. Eric's enduro bike just rolls. So much faster. Oh, wait a second. That's interesting. This is all new. Well, redone. Not new. Haven't ridden down here in a while. All right. This part of the line is open though. Good to. Hit some jumps. Feeling pretty good on the old rig. Oh yeah. Jumping like the dream. How's the old rock drop doing? Oh, no problem. 
Oh, that's a... I was running a little slower than I was expecting. But yeah, I just gotta get back to hitting these really quite large jumps. That's wet in here. I think probably from the sprinklers. Yeah, you gotta get used to hitting these big jumps again. Just gotta relax. Let the jump just do its thing. Then we got the moon boot. Nice. I'm a pretty nervous rider, so I don't like to just send big jumps full sand right off the bat. I like a nice little warm up. All right, coming into the last section of A-Line. Quite a good section. Let's see how we do on this Mach 10 tech. Uh, I never really know how I'm gonna feel on that section. Ooh, I like this jump though. Just a nice little guy. That jump's running quite well. Oh, now we come to the, the show-off jump. All right, back of the line, currently 12.30. Two laps in, <laughs> let's see when the third one is. 2,000 years later. All right, getting on the lift, 125. That was an hour? That's a, I mean, considering the line goes around that building, worth the fray line. All right, quick jaunt down B line again. Is it right? Oh yeah, right there. They come up here, sneak over to A line, or fade to black, Ninja Cougar. All right, Ninja Cougar. Quick few little corners. On to fade to black. Double black wood feature kind of North Shore style trail. That was uh, probably a little fast. I swear something's loose on my bike. Oh, it's running uh, quite smooth. Got a session in the drop? Yeah, session all the way. Pretty sweet. How old are you? I'm 12, he's... Wow, that's awesome, you guys are killing it. Yeah, I think this is like three years ago. I didn't even ride bikes when I was your age. Come on, I see this little kid do it. All right, good old-fashioned session. Man, something is definitely loose on my bike. I think my headset's loose, that's what it is. Alright, can you grab your bike? I gotta get my bike. You wanna train the whole thing now? Yeah. Should we stop after the step up, step down? See if Yuka wants to do it? So, uh, yeah, I'll just pull off to the side after. Yeah, like even if you case. <laughs> Jeez, they're gonna jump the whole thing. All right, rider. Come in here. Go on. 
Did it get a little drop here? That, that feels too easy now. <laughs> I'm landing in the middle and then you get to the drop really fast. You think maybe it's uh, your, you're feeling more comfortable with it so you're going faster? Alright, following Eric. Hmm, could I manual this? Ooh, I think I probably could. I think there's a pre-hop there too. Nice. Oh, so nice to be back in the park. Just getting lots of laps in. Nice, smooth trails. <laughs> All right, let's get a nice. Oh, warm. Sorry, I thought there was a <laughs> a rope across there. Thought the trail was closed. A nice warmed up ride through A-line here. I think I could do this pre-hop, but... Not today. This section of A-line is running real well. You know, I was worried that having pretty low pressure in the rear tire would be a little too squirmy, but... Oh god! <laughs> it's actually working out pretty well. I think with the Kush car and everything, even though I can feel it kind of compressed. All right, let's finish off with some more E line. Let's see, if I go really wide, that's slightly better. Whew. <laughs> Pulling up a little much on this bike, but... Oh, how did I go that slow? So I got the bike all tuned up, and one thing I've been super happy with is I've got the Noble TR38 carbon rims on here now, and it's pretty crazy how much better it made the bike feel. All right, angry pirate. Ooh, a little dark for the red lenses. I haven't ridden this in a while. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Those are fun. This is some great corners. Oh, right here too. Oh, this is always a little dicey. So dusty, dusty and slippery. Yeah, it's so nice to have these good carbon wheels on. I was just destroying the aluminum wheels. Oh, those corners are really fun. Woo. <laughs> Little marbly, little couple two wheel drifts. Oh, that part's always scary in the wet. All right, A line again. Can't go wrong. We keep meaning to ride on the trails. And yet, here we are, back at the A line. Whew. Thought I'd do a little toboggan there. Tiniest little one-hander. <laughs> I should really do that pre-hop. Oh yeah, 
<laughs> way too far. Way too far. Oh, I should really hit these jumps a little more instead of just airing them straight. There we go. All right, let's see here. Am I going fast enough? No. Oh, foot is off the pedal. That felt like a good table. Woohoo! That was a little too too much. I always forget what the line is here. Oh, there's a little hop here. <laughs> I like jumping from where you are. Yeah, like you can just come here. There's, there's more than a whole bike length for you. And then, uh, yeah, you can, you don't really need to brake. Maybe just a little light braking. Smooth. Uh, stay right. Uh, it's here. Oh yeah. You never know what this trail. There's a couple spots that are. Ooh. Drop. Ooh, another rock roll. Yeah, it's quite steep and not that grippy. One of my favorite trails. Oh yeah, that's that's tech. Good to have the downhill bike. Ooh. Yeah, it's so nice to have these strong wheels now. Just significantly stiffer. My old aluminum wheels were Quite, uh, quite floppy. Have some fun on the drops. This one's just not that big, but quite technical because you're right into the berm in there. Oh, I forgot there's a jump here. <laughs> if you make jumping noises, you go 10% farther. How'd it go? Good? Good. I did it. Oh, good job. Awesome. Good. I didn't crash. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Hey, well, we're going down to tech anyway. Emerge. And then, woo -hoo, big drop, Mach 10 jump. Oh, you can take that jump so fast, it's outrageous. All right. Eric's been going really fast through here, so I'm gonna let him lead. 
Wow. Oh, I think I had enough speed to jump that. That uh, root section. Ooh, big rock. I think this is where the downhill bike really shines. Is the like that fast, chunky tech. And then he's cooking right here. Nice. Finally getting the transfer. See, I like to go pretty wide here. Oh wow, he really hit that corner. All right, Schleyer. The second jump, I never know what to do. That jump's fine. Oh, that second jump is a little scary. I think it would go though. Just scary because it's like into some, like into some tech. Now here's the place of a million lines. The wheel destroyer. Oop. There was a wheel cruncher for you. Go up here. Oh yeah. And then you rage through the rocks. Come over here. Then you got a decent sized drop. The downhill bike really shines on this double black tech stuff. That, that's where, oh. <laughs> that's where it wants to be. Coming up on the Dwayne. It's quite fast. You want to come mock banana here and then jump the big jump. I don't want to do it. I, uh, well, maybe I will. Um, I'm just going to get used to it. I don't hit jumps this big on the small bike, so. Uh, 10, 20, 30 feet. All right, round two on the Dwayne. First time I hit this, I didn't feel like I did a great job. You know, it's quite fast. Woo! Drop time? Or do you want to look at it? I think it's, well, maybe you want to look at it? Sure, maybe we're here. Oh, there's a hole. There is a bit of a hole. Jump from that little clearing there and come down there, maybe eight feet. All right, tech to Elon. Oh, they've kind of added some dirt. <laughs> North Shore. Oh yeah, this is tech. Ooh, a little slidey. A little slidey. Remember, right, there's a little death route here. Yes, sir. That's it for opening day. See you guys in the next one.